The time is finally here for Idaho State University seniors to receive their degrees. Local News 8 reporter Cole Sam shows us how the grads are feeling ahead of tomorrow's commencement ceremony. This bell was ringing loud and proud as the university held its annual March Through the Arch celebration. Students who are earning their degrees got to walk through the Swanson Arch. It's the same one they walked through the start of their freshman year. Mal Lane says she walked into ISU as a pharmacy major and now exits as a music major. It was interesting to consider my path and reflect along the way um, of how far I've come and you know, the changes that have really helped me in my life and where I am now, I think wouldn't have happened had I not uh, become a Bengal and walked through that arch four years ago. Rebecca Moyaba says she fell in love with ISU when she was just 15. And now that her journey is concluding, it's a bittersweet dream come true. When I walked in, I was 17. I was just come from California and, you know, walking around, I was like, it's going to be four years. Here I am five years later graduating and going back through, but on the opposite side, it's kind of that feeling of someone just pinched me. And for Mauricio Avila, it's time to celebrate the end of a long and rewarding journey. All the times I've sacrificed, all the times my family sacrificed and my friends, we worked all worked hard to get that degree and just walking on that stage, especially after COVID, it's going to be really fantastic. ISU's graduation ceremony on Saturday will be held in its traditional format at Hold Arena. Even the ongoing construction there has meaning. The construction that's going on in Holt Arena is symbolic of what we're doing at a, as the university. We are investing in ourselves. We have construction projects in many places because we are investing in our future, the future of our students to move the university forward. ISU President Kevin Satterley says it's a day he looks forward to every semester. Graduation for me is fantastic because it represents the culmination of all we do. Those students who got their degree, who are going out to better their life through education, that's the reason and we do everything that we do. Reporting in Pocatello, I'm Cole Sams. Close to 2,000 graduates will be walking across the stage tomorrow in two different ceremonies throughout the day. The first one starts at 10 a.m., the second one starts at 2 p.m.